Hey guys, yo, what's up? My name's Seb. How are you guys doing? And today it's all about movies. A little bit games, but mostly movies. Let's go. Okay, so starting off, we've got patch 1.5 and next generation updates and list of changes. Yes, of course, Cyberpunk is doing a 1.5 patch. It's um, coming to PC, Stadia and consoles. It brings while well, improvements to games, numerous quests and gameplay fixes, as well as numerous free DLCs. On top of that, it contains the next generation update which will allow Cyberpunk 2077 to take advantage of the additional power of the Xbox Series XS and PlayStation 5 hardware. Here are the specs, take a look at them. It looks really cool and um, yeah, it, you can see just lots of the features done on here. Um, you can go to the links below to check out more about it, but yeah, it looks really cool. I'm excited for uh, the fact that when games do updates like this, they always make really good improvements, and I think it's always a good thing when a game does improvements, it fix bugs fixes, it makes the gameplay smoother, and it makes me want to play the game more, so yeah. especially when I haven't even stepped, dipped into the game properly just yet. I only dipped into this game just a little bit, just a little bit, but this makes me want to do it more now. So. Third Sonic movie on the way, plus Knuckles spin-off series starring Idris Elba. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for this. This is the third Sonic movie is on the way. That means the second one, obviously, you know. I, I, they haven't done the second one yet, so I don't even know why you know, they're doing a third one. They released the news that they're doing a third one on the way. But a Knuckles spin-off series, if this is true, I'm really excited for it. A Knuckles spin-off series would be so cool. So yeah, I'm excited for this. I can't wait to see if it'll actually push through and if it does, yes, come on. Halo is an upcoming American military science fiction television series that is coming out on the streaming service Paramount Plus. Yay, more stuff, more stuff. I don't even know if we got access to Paramount Plus in the UK, but on that note, having a Halo gameplay series, of course there's a risk of games and movies crisscrossing each other because eh, so yeah well good luck to the team and hopefully it's gonna look good bioshock movie is on the works at netflix oh yes if there's something that does work it will be bioshock bioshock is coming to netflix i'm scared because i only remember a little bit of bioshock i never actually really deeped into it i dipped into the first game a lot but I never dipped into anything more than that. And I now that I've heard of this and the amount of stuff that comes out of Bioshock, I really want to get back into this. So yeah, I'm in, yeah, awesome. Bioshock. Good on you. Yeah, do this. Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers. And of course, Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers. I'm so excited to see Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers for someone like me. This is like, oh yes. Um, I've seen a little bit of it, a little bit of spoilers, wait for the pause if you don't want to be spoiled, but there's one little bit I want to mention, is that in the movie that one of them is animated and the other one is 3D animated, one of them is 2D animated. Um, so I'm actually quite excited to see how they're going to pull that off and how they're going to spin it, you know, but I think it's going to work and I think they're really going to do some combat. There's going to be some comedy in this that we might not have seen before in other animated series, which is going to be really cool. So I'm really excited for that. Oh, I can't wait. I really want to see this. So, yeah. Right. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And now I have to go. So, goodbye. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to Jump Inside Games. Also, if you want to check out anything more about the Jump Inside community, then click any of the links down below.